Next was created um, for my two sons. So basically, um, you know, I've been in education for many years. Um, I first time came to Indonesia in 2005, so 19 years ago. So Indonesia has been my home and um, because I already lived in Indonesia, so I thought that, okay, if I want to do coding school, um, I will definitely do it in Indonesia because my kids live in Indonesia, I lived in Indonesia. So, because Indonesia was my home, so from the very beginning we decided that we will open Established Coding Next in, in Indonesia. I would like to be one of the leaders of coding education, not only in Indonesia, but in Southeast Asia. I recognize that Southeast Asia is my home. You know, Indonesia is my home, but we always try to look broader. So Southeast Asia definitely it's it's our uh, home. So at this moment we try to um, expand to Malaysia, Thailand, Philippines. So I would like to envision Coding Next as not only leader in Indonesia, but also in Southeast Asia and I always wanted uh, to have a coding school that it's the best, best for the students, the best for the parents and also the best for the employees. The very first thing uh, we always were talking to, especially our teachers, is to treat the students like they are your own child because Coding Next was created to Bart's child. Uh, that was the main push factor at the very beginning. Education is a responsibility, uh, so responsibility also how we shape the future of uh, younger generation. Uh, this we want to also our, student, our um, employees to understand. Uh, we always uh, help our employees to be innovative uh, and open-minded and also well-behaved. <laughs> of course, uh, none of the business is uh, made by itself uh, and definitely this is not a one-man show or two-man show. So, uh, without the team, which was always international, so we mix people from Europe, from, from other countries, and of course, strong core built by a uh, talented Indonesian. So yes, uh, the role of employees is, is crucial. Uh, we have a lot of talents, we have a lot of people who bring fresh uh, ideas and can also execute our ideas. Uh, dedikasi itu kan memberi diri, memberi waktu, memberikan apa yang kita punya dalam hal kemampuan dan juga uh, pekerjaan ya. Biasanya uh, dalam melakukan pekerjaan memang sangat dibutuhkan tentunya dedikasi. Buat saya di dunia kerja, dedikasi itu buat saya adalah memberi diri all out. Ketika kita berkomitmen menerima sebuah pekerjaan atau pelayanan, pasti kita harus melakukannya dengan sungguh-sungguh. Bukan semata karena apa yang akan kita dapatkan in return, tapi dedikasi itu memberikan semua daya yang kita punya terbaik yang bisa kita berikan untuk sebuah tujuan yang positif. Karena ketika perusahaan berkembang, tentu kita semua pasti akan berkembang dari nilai-nilai yang bisa kita tambahkan sebagai added value buat diri kita masing-masing. Iya, harapan saya terhadap guru-guru sebagai tim kerja saya bahwa guru itu suatu profesi yang luar biasa bagi saya pribadi karena guru bisa menjadikan seseorang yang tidak tahu menjadi tahu, seseorang yang tidak bisa menjadi bisa melalui proses belajar dan mengajar. Karena itu menjadi guru di Coding Next adalah sebuah privilege dan berkat yang mungkin teman-teman guru bisa dapatkan. Karena itu, lakukanlah yang terbaik dari versi diri Anda sendiri untuk menjadikan murid-murid itu tidak hanya paham teknologi, tetapi bijak menggunakan teknologi dan juga menjadi persaingan di dunia global mendatang. Ya, so the first step is uh, we look at global trends uh, by attending expos, by speaking to our partners around the world, uh, looking at the industry needs, and then once we understand that, 
we then go back to the drawing board and see how we can uh, curate those uh, learning experiences. And once we create those products that fit the industry needs, uh, the future needs, where we get feedback from teachers, feedback from students, uh, and then try to improve and make the best uh, product and do it all over again for different uh, aspects of our customers. Yeah, I mean, first, I'm very fortunate to have a really great team, got diverse skill set, we've got some uh, professionals in IT, uh, people skilled with IT training, got curriculum specialists uh, who specialize in AI or early childhood or a platform, so really diverse. So my method simple, I don't micromanage. I like to set the learning outcomes, I like to empower them, and I like to be there for them and help them along the way. Yeah, it just makes everything worth it. It's not an easy task. At times it can be repetitive, can be a very um, daunting. But once you see the kid who didn't know how to put together a simple project, now makes his own games and apps and websites, this makes it all worthwhile and makes us uh, have the motivation to do it all over again. So it's really a re rewarding to be able to have that impact. For me, success is if children love learning, that's a measure of success. We don't want them all to become computer engineers and scientists, but if they can love what they do and discover who they are through technology, for me that's a big success. I hope the quality will win because uh, we always focus on the quality. Uh, we always try to make it the best uh, in terms of methodology, in terms of the content. So I hope uh, this approach will be sustainable. I hope we can cover more and more students and uh, my personal goal is to make it as much as uh, possible available for also unprivileged uh, students. So those who maybe not necessarily can afford the uh, programs which we have. So that's why we are very innovative. So I hope uh, Coding Next will help to build good next generation of Indonesian. Um, the students which are able to use technology for good, uh, with strong moral values and with strong creativity to solve the problems we have in this world. First of all, thank you very much to all of the coding next team members. You know, you are like family. So thank you very much for all of your support, all of hard work, all of the ideas, time, effort that you spend with us. Uh, message is simple, just dream big. Uh, if you have any ideas, come to us, talk to us, your ideas can be also implemented uh, and be happy. Come to work, have fun, uh, you know, teaching kids, it's one of the best things you can do uh, in, in your life. But also being a manager, being a, you know, a team that supports uh, this whole, you know, uh, school activities. It's definitely a very, very fruitful um, job. job, you know, so stay happy, be open, uh, have ideas and have a lot of fun. Eight years of inspiration, innovation and dedication.